Okay. Uh, this is Glenda with Freelands and Friends Crafts Plus. I'm in the craft room today. I'm going to do some organizing with these. And however many we need. <laughs> Got me. Oops. <laughs> I need to get this one kind of fixed up and have him gloss it because I don't know. They seem to work better out of the other clay. Anyhow, let's get busy. give you an idea of what just happened so that it's not in okay I did put some things up there to get them out of the way but this I used a, quite a few containers got rid of some stuff reorganized and it's probably not the best it could ever be but it's better than it was Oops, that is as far out as it goes. I took that sheet off for that cloth off because it was just getting so full of junk. And it was covering this stuff. <laughs> this is my access down here. And down here. <sighs> so, <laughs> now that you've seen me organize this thing help me keep it straight <laughs> say Glenda clean up your mess <sighs> it, it does feel so good to have at least I can find where everything is and all of the all of the Play stuff is pretty much taking up half the table, but it's pretty much together. And back here we've got miscellaneous, but usable or useful. Oh, there's one of the, where I put my containers, but they're leftovers that I might use in the future. And of course, I've also got the one behind the curtain. <laughs> I do want to get rid of that curtain. <sighs> Oh, what a day. I think we might get some some rain this evening. I don't know. It's a little dusky. Not dusky. Ah, uh, clouded over. Ah, <laughs> uh, pardon my hair. After all of that work, it's just the worst for wear. Like me. Oh. Oh, the leaves are starting to turn on our, on our tree in the front. I did find out even if the city won't let us cut down those trees, we can trim them as we like. So there's some lower limbs that I'm going to have trimmed next year. Because <sighs> otherwise there just isn't any sun to... To grow things with at least unless it's a shade plant which is what we got well my battery is wanting to go again so I am gonna say good night and I want to ask you to please pray for people in Colorado who are affected by the fires I have a cousin in Fort Collins and 
she's been posting pictures the last week but it's getting to the point where it's close enough today she's been posting pictures where smoke and ash are coming down and covering very close to where she's at pray for her safety and good night